Hello everybody, I'm TGG and welcome back to this tutorial series. In today's episode, I am going to show you how to make this. So, as you can see over here, I've made a block of water. And if I throw in an iron ingot and if I throw in a coal afterwards, they get turned into a diamond. But if I throw in uh, a, an iron ingot and a coal over here, outside of the water, they do not get turned into a diamond. Let's get into the coding. Okay, so first things first, let's change the radius because this is the wormhole plugin with the converter. Uh, and I'd like to edit this so that it uh, is a item combiner instead of an item converter. So let's change the radius of the three to three to a half, zero and a half. This will check in a one by one block radius with uh, the item being the middle of that radius. So we can just remove this and what we want to do is we want to check if end is equal is an instance of an item stack entity and uh, we can do this by doing end instance of item and item is not the item stack it's the item entity. So what we are going to do is item and let me just correctly import all things over there with Ctrl Shift O if you didn't catch that in one of the first episodes now here's your quick handy shortcut in Eclipse Ctrl Shift O to auto import stuff okay so item uh, if end is instance of item so what we are going to do is of course we are going to make a variable out of that item end and uh, with that item so that item is um, the iron so we throw the coal and we want to check if there's an iron ingot nearby so what we are going to do is item dot get item stack to get type and it should equal of course material dot iron ingot iron ingot and just for this tutorial I want to check if get item stack dot get amount equals one so that we do not have to keep track of how many items there is it's easy, just figure it out. It's kind of the midi challenge of today's episode. So, okay, uh, get amount equals one. And as you can see, I made it in such a certain way that only the items that are inside of a water block, a stationary water block, change into the new diamond. So, what we are going to do is we are going to check if item, so that's the found item, dot get location, uh, dot get block isn't equal to null and item dot get location dot get block dot get type equals material dot and as I said stationary water you can check any kind of block you can also check for blocks in the side of a radius if you want to have like a bigger structure I might do something about multi block uh, structures in a future episode so what we are going to do is check for stationary water and there's two things we need to do now because we want to remove the iron ingot and change the coal into a uh, diamond. And of course, as you already know, you know how to remove entities and it's the entity, so item.remove. And over here, e dot get item drop dot set item stack new item stack material dot diamond. And if they throw away a whole stack, now they're going to lose the whole stack and only get one diamond in return. So what you want to do is you really want to make the check with all the amounts. And that's actually how you make the item combiner. You do not have to check if the, um, the, 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 the coal is inside of water. Because what we do over here is we only check on a horizontal plane. So only in the X and Z direction. Not actually in the Y direction. So it's within one block so the yeah the, the diamond can only be created in stationary water and you can only throw it in the water otherwise it will not get created and you've already seen it in the beginning of the episode no need to go back into the server again so this will be it for today's episode hope you enjoyed if you did leave a like if you want to see something about uh multi-block structures make sure to comment down below that you want to see that and i will get into it i'm also doing other cool stuff right now don't worry there will be cool stuff in the future so thanks for watching if you want to see more of course you want that subscribe
and I'll see you next time.